So welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to do a little vlog for you and I'm going to take you shopping with me. As you know, I've got a couple of weddings coming up um, and today I am shopping with my family for the outfits for my brother's wedding, which is all very exciting. So I have been cleaning like a crazy person just to try and, you know, make sure that everything's in order for when they arrive. Does anyone else get nervous when their parents visit? I think you spend so many years at your parents' place that you then forget, oh God, they've got to come to mine. And this is the second time that my parents have ever been to mine. Like my place, my rentals, maybe two or three times, but like five times my whole lifetime that they've been to one of my homes. I mean, they need to visit more. Just saying. Mum, if you're watching, you need to visit more. Anyway, I am very excited for this. It's going to be good. Just got cash. This isn't what I'm going to be wearing for the whole thing, but you know. I'm excited. Let's go. Actually, why don't I take you on a little flat tour as well whilst we're going. So, here we have my bedroom. Dun, 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 dun. Pink, pink, pink. That is my like Monica corner. If you watch Friends, when you know, you know. I need to sort that. Right. Out into the grand foyer. Rock and roll through the hallway. That just has a boiler in it. it takes up so much space or a soda panel thing. The bathroom. Yes, pink, 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 pink. Obviously not everything, but some of my grab bags that I use most frequently into the main accommodation. Dun, 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 dun. Kitchen, I hate the color of this kitchen. I thought it was white, it's cream. That was only because the walls were magnolia, which hid that from me. And then here we have the beautiful pink sofa. And then this fun little section here. And again, more pink, more shoes, few heels. Love, there you go, guys. That is the pad. Here we go, guys, full look. I feel like I wear this coat all the time, but it's so amazing. But then I've got my Kurt Geiger trainers on, my Kurt Geiger double XL flap, and then just a super cash outfit, Lacoste sunglasses. What a dream. Boop. And away we go. Let's look at some shops. Okay, so we went into Moss Bros to have a little look at some suits and some different bits. This is their kind of rental section, but it gives you a good idea of some of the styles that are available that you could be thinking about. I was quite drawn to this white um, jacket, but oh my word, could you imagine knowing me? I'd throw pasta sauce all over it or something. What a disaster that would be just coming down into the main body of the store. They had some really lovely pieces, actually. I really do like Moss as a brand. Definitely good to consider. Okay, so here we are in John Lewis. Not anything that was really grabbing anybody. Um, quite expensive, actually. Um, we did look at linen um, stuff, but it creases so easily. Just a few nice accessories here. Um, I particularly like that black bow tie, and they had some nice belts, etc. June shoes, always a big fan of June shoes. Really liked these boots, not my normal style, but I really liked the colour. I thought they were great. Not £115 worth though, but you know, they would be great, comfy. This is their homeware, very, very nice. Lots of colour. How beautiful were these gin bottles? Oh, that colour is glorious. Mulberry had some fabulous pieces. I actually did a poll on my Instagram for those Alexas to see what, uh, which colour people would go for. And the majority said blue over green. Loved this bottle green, but they'd stuffed this Bayswater terribly. It looked really, really bad, actually. Quite bulbous. Here we are. These were the two that I asked about. You chose the blue over the green. And about 50 people said blue, about 30 said green. This pink tote, beautiful. Stunning. Oh, this is a gorgeous tote. So subtle, but so beautiful. Look at that colour. Loved it. And a few more Alexas. Actually, the Alexa is really growing on me and I really like the knotted handle. Here we are, just a little bit of footage from some of the other sections. Nothing that I was particularly looking at, but thought you might just want to see where I was off to and what I was doing. Okay, this is a bit of a dupe of the Coco handle, but it's cute from June. They had a few dupes. Oh, my love, Kurt Geiger. Look at this beaded Kensington. So beautiful. What a showstopper that would be. Love this. Obsessed with this green. This is incredible. The black hardware with the green tweed. Oh, amazing. 
Some really fun pieces. Lots of colour. Very bright, very bold, very vibrant. You can't help but have fun when you're wearing Kurt Geiger. It's just great. Look at these trainers. So I think these are the Laney's. Um, and just love the love the print. This really cute purple micro Kensington. Necklace, micro bag, whatever you want to do. It's there. Loved these drench bags. The white is beautiful, but I would worry about colour transfer. Oh, I love a good American sweet shop. These were so fabulous. Didn't end up buying anything, but oh, what a great place to go and have a look. Jelly Belly, best jelly beans in town. Love that. So much candy. Not eye candy, straight up candy. These pictures are from one of the galleries. Oh, this is gorgeous. I absolutely loved this piece. It's by an artist called Emily Crook. Um, and they're just so fun. These in someone's foyer would be fabulous. Um, I love them. I thought they were fabulous. Here we go. Just a couple more kind of jackets. Um, I think this might have been Marks and Spencer, you know. My dad always used to love Marks and Spencer because the, um, because the suits were machine washable, which made them very practical, but um, didn't always feel the nicest. Thought this tie was really cute. Liked this a lot. Liked the flamingos. Thought it was good fun. This was my baby for the day. I took out my Kurt Geiger Kensington in the denim, thought I would give it some love, and it was fabulous. Oh, the muscles have forgiven me. For those who didn't know, I got food poisoning from seafood a few months ago, and they forgave me. So this was today's outfit. So we whizzed back to the shopping centre, um, just to kind of hang out, and I wore this with my MCM tote, which you know I love. There. It is in all its glory. Love the fact that it's two pieces. Oh, this is such a good bag. I cannot recommend it enough. Mum also made this glorious Rocky Road. How good does this look? Biscoff and white chocolate Rocky Road. Oh, yum. I loved. So I'm filming the last bit from my bedroom because one of my neighbours has been doing cleaning. I don't know if they're cleaning their car, if they're cleaning their flat, whatever it is. But my word, they've been going for a very long time. And it's so bloody noisy. So anyway... We're trying to get a bit of a quiet space. I thought I'd just quickly show you a couple of the pieces that I bought. Nothing uber glamorous, but just some fun stuff. I hope you enjoyed coming shopping with me and having a look at a few different things. Um, we did manage to find the suits, which is great news, but obviously I won't be showing you those because that shouldn't be seen until the day itself. So very exciting, but I did buy a couple of bits, which I'm quite excited about. Um, so the first bit was super cute. Um, just a couple of pairs of socks. These ones are adorable because for those of you who don't know, I lived in the Falkland Islands for a period of time. So this is really nice just to have a little bit of a nod to that whole piece. What's interesting here was $7.95, now $2.95, but then the label itself at the back says $4.95. So they are Billy bullshitting about that $7.95 because the original label was $4.95. Not good, Moss Bros. Okay, original label, $7.95, $2.95. Again, just purple ones, Moss. These will be nice with the jacket that I've got that has purple flex in it, um, just to kind of match the sock with that. And then I thought these happy socks were really, really good fun. Was £5, now $2.95. Original label says £5. So that's truthful. So these are lovely. These are the standouts for me because, like I said, they have that nod to the time that I spent overseas when I lived in the Falklands. Final thing from Moss is this navy blue t-shirt. But what I really like about this is that it's almost slightly kind of knitted. I don't know how well that will come out, but it's almost like a knitted uh, material. It's got the um, almost the like cuffs on the arms that like a bit of a jogger and same on the bottom. So it just gives it a little bit of shape, but I think this will be warm, um, but comfortable and, and quite airy and just a really nice thing to wear. So I'm quite looking forward to this and seeing what that brings for me. And then finally, as you know, I have a rather formal sense of style and I saw this beautiful tie that I absolutely loved by Scott and Taylor. And I just think it's beautiful. I love this very soft pink with the baby blue. I just think it's beautiful. And I love the paisley print. So I'm very excited to wear this. I do like wearing ties and I like wearing ties with outfits that are formal enough, but then they have casual elements to them. So maybe I would wear a suit and tie 
but more of a tailored suit and then stick a pair of trainers with it. So I just think that's a really fun way of wearing a tie, mixture of formal with a bit more casual. Nice, that's what outfits are all about. Anyway, thank you so much as always for watching me and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Take care everyone, bye now. Mwah.